Hey guys and welcome to my video. So today I'm talking about the new patch. So actually, finally we have a good patch away from the other one. Was actually last one was so bad. Actually made me go to sleep more than playing the game. So this one have some good points. So let's see what we have. So first we have the third pit for Gunner. I'm not sure how it's going. It's good or not. So anyway, I will do this on my stream today. I will give it a try and actually until I make my video, maybe I will make my overview video tomorrow on Friday. So I'm not sure yet, but I will do my best so I can do videos for it as fast as I can. So anyway, share the stream today. It's good for you. Okay, other things that class change system and that's something important. So for sure, for anyone who wants to change his class, as I as example, if I am hit my blade master and I want to go for force master, so that's maybe your chance to do this with your gears. So I will make a video about this later also. Maybe I will make something about it on the stream. So change the stream again. Okay, so we have also Demon Bane Dungeon, the tail supply chain for Poharan. Not sure how it's going yet because I didn't play it yet. For sure, I will play it today on a stream also. Okay, two new event and we have the drop stretch game. This game actually you are jumping around above some sand and it's dropping. We'll make also video about this later. New gems, not something important. Soul shield because of the new dungeon. That's something important. And there is a mystery duelist bundle. I don't even care about this. So anyway, let's go for the main points for us. First thing I will talk about, it's something about PvP, about Battleground. So actually they made additional states on just two hours. It will give you the states for your character. I'm not sure if it's just this states or actually your items plus this states. So since then we go a bit, a bit different so actually we'll have like 3 million hp and some pvp defense at that power some big points and big numbers you will have it on this time so actually this in 10 made sense maybe equalize it a bit but if you are using your items anyway so for sure your items can make some different on your dbs or your damage but at least you will not take one hit that's at least what i expected so maybe i will give it a try soon and i made video about it if i have time on a stream or this time in my stream time i will do it also okay so also we have changed the class system away from i will talk about this on another video but i will talk about some points there is a bundle with 800 train so uh, sorry 8000 train in train so i'm not sure if there is any way away from this bundles or not so let's a shit in game okay so here on f10 okay so here on features you will find or featured you will find the class change launch bundle for sure it was in train i don't think they given us anything for free as i can see so you will have to use this if you want to change your class for me i will not change anything so i don't care about it and this one will give you character alter alteration voucher and pit patch seated oils some some items just to make you buy it nothing more than this and the class change voucher so it can change your class okay for this one it will give you just this Character alteration plus change and weapon it's a change voucher that's for sure because you will have as an example you have a pvp weapon and pve weapon like this one shadow fury for me and this one for me dragon fend so you want to make this two go to your other character so you will change them like this details will be on the other video because i don't want to go for some bit points for no reason so let's talk about our event. If I will go here and go for the Runner Cypress, go for the Force One. That's the items you can get from the event. The event is kind of simple. You will play the dungeon. You can play it like five times per day. It have like half an hour you can choose it. So if I shit from here. Actually there is an icon. Should be find it here. I didn't see it yet, but I expect it will be right here. So I will go from it to the event dungeon. And actually you have to cross about some obstacles or something you will jump on it and if you fall you will lose and you have 12 men with you so you can give it a try until you can do it so it will be not something i don't think it will be on f8 you will find it like this like color liar and for sure i think it will not be on the same time as color liar so maybe it one hour later one hour less you will go for there and finish it and you will get like 
20 from this train so the sun will be like this from monday to sunday okay it's uh, light from it's every week or every day so it will be like this the time not sure how it was this time will be for you so anyway you can shit it yourself and you will understand so what you can get you will get this 20 drop stretch that's the item for the or the currency for the event you will get it and you can buy something with this that's a daily completion if you finish this at least one of the participants cross to the final place or you can reach the goal if you didn't finish this so you will never get this reward but you can try five times per day so you don't have any problem if you do it again you can get one more so you can get 21 and i don't think you will get anything from daily rewards or let me check i don't think so as i can see so you have nothing to do but just do this dungeon so you can get the event currency what you can get with this so you have this outfit not bad actually it's bad on men and this one with the headpiece it will be like this okay i can get this one it's not bad for others like always but today or this time they put in senior chest it will not be that important to say it's limited uh, to per character so you can get a lot for your other characters you have sacred vials account limit by two pet pairs like always so nothing you can gain more than this other event as we have treasure trove normally we don't have a spin but this time we have the spin with the treasure trove and actually we have some different things we can get from here so if i will go for the daily dash as example i got the i got this one the sterling steel fragments they put this on the daily dash so they put some other rewards so refine honing oil divine dress stones brilliant aerodrome insignia chest sterling steel and that's the important one other things i don't care about them still support chest fragment support chest Deluxe daily challenge treasure chest pet pet on in hond moon gym powder nothing more that's the event and nothing more than this okay so down for another point there is a still update nothing important to say most of them is fixed but i will tell you the important things on double blades i actually changed some icons so you can expect which stance you are on it on the shifting the blades because sometimes you get distracted and then understand which one is this and which one is this so this maybe will make you not confused that much but nothing important away from this soul fighter you have just this one change your shunt to trigger the grapple effect for six seconds when used on npc or three second when used on in pvp so it's good for this a change or shunt to deal this damage or this percent of damage for such second and this damage for pvp nothing important more than this warden nothing important auto hunt skill all of this is not important for assassins because this one is a bit confusing you have the dynamic kit this one that can make you knock down someone it was normally with your right click if you are using it in simple mode so maybe you will use it with if something like this i can't remember which one was which one so whatever they now made it on lmb on your left button on your mouse and that's for all speeds that's something for assassins for gunner just firefall is working with airborne and other things is not important so other sense item update so we have insignia they will not give any information but for sure you have more insignias as we have a new dungeon so there is something for sure is working with the new dungeon for sure they put it i didn't read yet but for sure it will be like this a strategy card that's for the cards you use on the solo dungeon so some of them they buffed them actually so they changed the additional damage on intensity from just 600 percent to 3600 percent so that's a lot of buff not sure how it will perform with you so maybe i will give it a try later for precision it changes the critical hit chance to deal 7.2 percent additional attack power damage from 12 percent to 30 percent i think that's the chance to happen i think it increased from 12 to 30 that's what i sent and the damage will be like this so anyway it can help you make some damage on them for this one turn to change the critical hit additional attack power damage to an enemy with 
20% or less health from this to this. So actually from 270 to 6070 or 750. So kinda so much. Not sure how it will perform also. But I expect especially this one and this one can do something different this day. Okay, so for the most important thing on this patch, it's dungeon for sure. So Poharan dungeon, let's just shit inside the game. If I will do for ah by the way, then of the enchant is working for a change. Actually, finally after not sure how many it's like three months or maybe more than this. From the time they made the soul boost, I sent it's not working. So anyway, you can do it. Don't worry, you can play it finally. So anyway, let's take a look about our dungeon and for this one, not this one, almost. I'm pressing the wrong buttons. So for your dungeon, for sure you don't expect the difficulty. So to expect the difficulty, first send chaos supply chain. It's just 20 stages, not 80 stages like what before. So this one, just 20. 20, starting the stage one. As you can see, it's between stage one for aerodrome and substratum and stage 11 and the room so anyone almost can play this you don't have any problem so what you can get from this you can get soul shields from 1 to 8 you have no problem with this the normal soul shield this soul shield for sure is stronger than what i have right now so it's stronger than the shadow fury soul shield so you have to aim for this other items you can get poharan pit gym Okay, that's a pit gym and it's not tradable and not upgradable and all of things you want to say. And you, if you are lucky, you get orthogonal pit gyms. So I'm not sure if that's the old orthogonal. It's orthogonal normally, not gilded orthogonal. So I sent it's useless one. Anyway, we don't care about this. The site is you can get from here. You have pirate site. And this one used for the soul shield, so it can boost your soul shield for Baron soul shield and read some sighties to use it more, and things will be good. And actually, it's dropping from stage one, so that's something good for you for sure. Okay, Poharon, that's a pirate one from one to four, and Poharon from five to eight. Other things, some Poharon insignia as example, can drop here. That's a chest, and others kind of normal. So. Okay, let's go for something else. If I will go for stage 5, stage 5 actually going with stage 41. So I can say stage 5 will be strong enough or maybe challenging enough. So what you can get from here, you can get actually the outfit from here. It will be this one. Kinda good enough. Will not say it's good, it's good enough. From here, you can get the soul shield from all summon from 1 to 8. But actually, it have a chance to drop the true Poharan Soul Shield. So true Poharan Soul Shield, it will be something stronger than the normal Soul Shield. As I saw it before on Dungeons, I sent it will be a color like blue color, not yellow color like always when you drop a legendary. So you will know if you did the true one from just looking to your chest, you will understand that's the true one. That's not the normal one. They are starting or not. Actually, I don't know this information yet because i didn't try but i don't expect they will start like you will have or you will need at least three so you can get the set effect but set effect i don't think will work with like seven from this and one from this i don't think it will work so anyway until we check for sure okay same pitch gym this one is a bit better so you can get this one will give you better and the chest one is a square so this chest it will be orthogonal on the other one so for sure the normal orthogonal and other better sins. Okay, so stage five, at least you will need to play it. So it ended the true soul shield. That's the thing you have to aim for it. And for sure, if you tend to aim for it that fast, so get whatever you can get from Poharan soul shield, then get true soul shield as you want and spam it. For stage 10, it's like 51. So maybe it's something will be normal for a character like mine. Not sure. If you are less than this, if you can play it or not, for sure we will try and days will tell everything. So also here, things didn't change that much, as I can see. Nah, not a bit of change, so almost the same items. And actually the match send you can get from stage 15. I'm not sure if this send you can play it at the moment or not, or maybe you need to get stronger. So until we can see this, but I actually don't see any bit different from this. So anyway, what you have to aim for on this patch, 
aim for this for her on for sure try to get your eight soul shields if you can get the true one get your eight one from the true soul shield and things will be fine for you that's what you have to focus on it on this patch last thing away i don't feel it that important gems you have now better gems you have the octagonal one from the gilded so it's simply something like this one so you can get it right now i don't feel anything good from this especially prices didn't change so it's useless if i will say it like what you will get from this look to the states okay you have maybe more attack powers but i don't see anything and actually i think um the effect is still wrong person and there is no critical hits so maybe it's not working well if we check something like um purple one show me this uh so just accuracy and attack power no life drain so i sent things that's not working well on them yet so anyway i don't feel that is strange we have this game it's always having so much about so much about so i don't even care about this anymore <sighs> what to say it's always like this on bread and soul so anyway that's it for the patch don't see anything strange on it for sure Poharan patch uh, or Poharan dungeon is what you aim for it's a good one the event is actually i think it's funny didn't try it yet but i expect it funny and for other send just sir respect donor well made videos about it like always overview and the pv and the pve if i can pvp i will make it also so anyway until these days thank you for watching guys don't forget to subscribe support my channel i was feeling so down lately actually i wasn't even made videos for brother and soul so try to support me so i can encourage again and get more power and do things as i want so, see you in the next video, guys. Bye-bye.